attack ad from Barack Obama's team. If you have not seen it yet, check it out. Roll it here. 1982, John McCain goes to Washington. Things have changed in the last 26 years, but McCain hasn't. He admits he still doesn't know how to use a computer, can't send an email, still doesn't understand the economy, and favors 200 billion in new tax cuts for corporations, but almost nothing for the middle class. After one president who was out of touch, we just can't afford more of the same. Can't I'm use Barack a computer, this can't message. send an email, can't type on a keyboard. Bill Burton, spokesman for the Obama team, with us again from Chicago. Bill, good morning to you. Why, why was that important to have that in the ad? Uh, well, that ad is important overall because it says something about John McCain and how in touch he is with the American people's lives. You know, just today, just moments before Did it uh, you and I started you talking. That he can't Hold on one second, Bill. Just moments before you and I started talking. Because of Vietnam War wounds he well, suffered for what, five what, and a half years of captivity? One second, Bill. Let me just answer your Did question. Did you know that? Yeah, what, just before, so I can answer your question. Bef just before you and I started talking, John McCain said on stage that the fundamentals of our economy are strong. And so that ad that talks about the fact that uh, John McCain's out of touch. He's, he doesn't know how to use a computer. And he, he also said email. in the same sentence that, you know, Wall Street's got issues and if I'm president, I'll clean this stuff up. Back to the point. Did you know he can't use <laughs> okay. a key? Um, now, I'm I, just quoting from what I'm reading from I the, the campaign that. rally I in Jacksonville, that, Florida. John McCain just thinks the fundamentals of our my economy question, are strong, answer, then he should stand by that <laughs> comment. As for your question about whether or not Please. he can use a computer, I read an interview with him in the New York Times and another with him in the San Francisco Chronicle where he said that he was in fact learning how to use a computer and he was learning how to email, but he wasn't quite there yet. So Did it occur to you that, that the, the injury she suffered in the Hanoi Hilton is the reason why? Why he was still using, learning right. how to use a computer? And, and unable to type on a keyboard, were you aware of that? I think that I was aware of the fact that he had specifically said that he was learning how to use a computer. So I think that if he's learned how to use a computer, I think that he ought to because the internet is the so backbone. So you're saying you weren't aware of, of that. that? That's your answer then, right? No, my answer is that if John McCain is so out of touch with the American people's lives that he doesn't understand what's going on in their homes on their computers, doesn't understand how the internet affects our economy, doesn't understand that the fundamentals of our economy are not but strong, if you knew we are that actually he, in a crisis and has no plan to address it, that he then that's flesh, something that they should be able to stand up for. If he gave flesh for the country and you knew that he couldn't use a keyboard because his arms and shoulders were broken by the Viet Cong four decades ago, is that fair game? Bill, I understand that you keep making this exact same point, but if he wasn't learning how to use a computer and he wasn't learning yeah, how to I'm email, then why yes does he... Yes or no, is it fair then, game? Do you think... Bill, do you yes think or no, was he learning how to use a computer? I, 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 correct, but I'm asking right, yes or that's no. That's the exact point. Uh, you're is not going to answer that. Let's go to another point, okay? Right, because people the fact over is the he's age, out of touch, and that's he, what that ad shows. People because, over the age of 65 vote in this country, and you know it. That is absolutely right. Now, and most of them after, are out there using computers. When you go the after John the McCain internet, and ads as like these. As it relates these, to our economy. Wow, we're not getting anywhere. Uh, are you going to take that group and just kiss them off in November? Is that what you're effectively doing? <laughs> Bill, I think that people understand that. In order to understand the crisis that our middle class faces, in order to understand the challenges that people are facing right now and what's going on in people's lives, you do have to have a general understanding of what's going on in people's lives, be it health care costs, energy costs, or how the internet has an impact on our economy. And he doesn't. He's completely out of touch. That's why he keeps saying the fundamentals of our economy are strong when they are not. That's why he has the, no plan let, to let, get let us out of this economic in crisis that we're in right now. This. In the state of Minnesota, it's now tied 45-45. Why is that, Bill? It's close all over the country. And Minnesota is a state I care deeply about. I'm a golden gopher. I'm proud of it. Our basketball team's looking good. But it's a place where the American people are, um, you know, closely divided. People are learning more about Obama. They're learning more about John McCain and his dishonest campaign. And when they sit all down right. and they really think about the choice, they know that Barack Obama's for fundamentally changing our economy, making it stronger. I hear your point. John McCain is for just more I, I, of the I same. hear your point. I asked you a lot of questions. Some of you answered part way, but next time we'll do it again, okay? All right, Bill. Bill Burton in Chicago with the Obama campaign. 19 minutes past the hour. Fair and balanced, as always. Well, Hurricane Ike is shutting down a large portion of the nation's refining capacity as it tore through.